episode of Watch Once Over. My name is Biggie. Today we're going to be looking at this beautiful Bear Grylls Luminox. And this is really nice. This is model XB3745ECO. And this one is really, really cool. This is available right now at azfinetime.com for the price of $9.75 retail dollars. And this watch is just totally cool. But before we check this one out, here's a little bit more about azfinetime.com. Arizona Fine Time is located in Scottsdale, Arizona. And I'll leave a link to their website in the description. They stock many, many luxurious and great brands like Maurice Lacroix, Seiko, Seiko Lux, Tutima, Luminox, Laco, Mule Glissute, and exclusive brands like High End G Shock, Accutron, Ball, and many, many others. Come check us out, and you're going to love what you see. Thanks. Okay, guys, we're back. Now, we're looking at this beautiful 45 millimeter conservation piece. This is um, a Bear Grylls Luminox, and this is um, uh, also a conservation piece, and it uh, is in conjunction with the company Tide. I'm trying to find that on there right here. So you have a triple trifecta um, collab here. You have Luminox in the middle. You have Tide, which is a recycling uh, company that recycles ocean plastics. And then you have Bear Grylls. Up the top, you got every second count. And then the wave motif on this dial. And then never give up on the bottom. This watch is really cool. It's packed with a lot of different special features. And this colorway, it's like a yellow mustard. And this is pretty cool. Now let's start from the top. You have a sapphire crystal along with this special save the... Um, uh, Ocean's Edition case, which is made out of uh, upcycled uh, plastic, and this strap, which is heavy duty and super thick, is actually made out of um, fish nets, um, actually from the ocean. So all this is ocean-bound plastic, and um, uh, for the case, and then this strap is made out of uh, fish nets that uh, come out of the ocean. It's a 24 millimeter strap with a quick release on here. And this case is really, really tough, um, uh, like the uh, Carbonox cases. Uh, now, this is cool. You have a 60-click bezel with a really heavy detent. And I like that. And you do get a uh, tritium on this one. This one doesn't have Super Luminova. It has an um, even more powerful uh, type of lumen, which is uh, tritium gas tubes. And I'll show you that in a second. Now, along with that 60-click bezel, um, you have this 60-second um, uh, scale and uh, looks like dive, uh, maybe decompression marks for here. Um, I don't know exactly, but it's for something, some type of timing. Now, if you look close at the dial, let me move in. On, on the re-halt, um, you have never give up. And let's just read them all. You have uh, add and split time functions. I'll show you that the chrono chronograph does have a split function. And then you have um, case uh, ocean material uh, case, uh, sapphire crystal, and then you have uh, 20 atmospheres, which is 200 uh, meters of water resistance. And then last but not least, you have a built-in SOS code right here. So if you forget the uh, save our ship code, um, you can look at your watch and remember, and I think that's real cool. Now, on the chronograph portion of it, it is a split chronograph, so you can time two different events simultaneously. So I got the chronograph running, and then you have um, the six o'clock subdial and the nine o'clock subdial um, are the uh, attached to the chronograph, and the chronograph has a red second hand that, that you see going around now. Now, if I push this button which is a start stop it this is for the split time so I push it and it stopped but the chronograph is still timing internally so then I hit the start stop again you see nothing happens so that's the first time then I hit the split and it shows you what the second time is so I think that's pretty cool to have a split uh, second chronograph on here um, I like that a lot now on the dial 
Let's move in a little bit more. You have the uh, Bear Grylls uh, uh, X there, the cancer symbol. And then you have um, black subdials with uh, concentric circles on there at the 9 and uh, 3 o'clock. You have a date um, date wheel right at 6 o'clock, which is tastefully placed. Uh, black background with white printing. And then all these uh, indices, some are horizontal and some are vertical. And you have three different colors of um, of uh loom on here of tritium and let me show you that right now and this signal mustard yellow just pops I like this color uh, yellow it's it's not your run-of-the-mill yellow it's more of a mustard yellow and um, it's something that you can wear every day uh, it's, it's not too uh, out there uh, let me cut the studio light so you can see this better that's what you'll get at nighttime. You'll get the three colors of loom. You get blue on the second hand and on the sub dials. And then you'll get uh, orange at the 12 o'clock pip over Luminox and on the uh, rotating bezel. And then all the rest of the tubes are going to be green. And then they're going to be horizontal and vertical opposing each other. And then on the hands, you have a green and a... Um, and an orange one on the um, minute hand. Uh, so it's it's really nice uh, triple colored tubes, real colorful. This thing will light up um, in the night. Um, it, it's just going to be awesome once you go to sleep and you roll over and you see this. And these tritium tubes really come to life uh, once your uh, eyes adjust. Now you have a rubber uh, uh, covered um, crown. I'll show you that. This is sand, as you can see, with the Luminox symbol. And then on these screw-down uh, pieces, let me move in. They have writing on there. Reset. And then you have the orange one for your start-stop button. And I, I think that's really cool. But these don't um, screw in and out. They, these, oh, wait a minute, hold on. No, these don't screw down, I don't believe. No, they don't screw down. Just this crown screws down, but you do get 200 meters of uh, water resistance. Now, the hands are sword-style hands. Uh, while we're up close, they're all black. And that contrasts real well against this yellow background, so you can see it real easy. Now, um, right under the uh, rehole, you have a stadium-style ring that is green that holds your uh, compass uh, markings in orange north east south and west on that green ring so now you have three colors going you have these earthy colors going um, with the brown and then the green and then you have the pop of yellow um, for instant uh, notification and report of where the hands are easy to see and um, Super, super functional. This is one of the coolest watches Bear Grylls have made with Luminox. And like I said, on the back, you get the quick uh, release um, strap, which is 24 millimeters. And you get a screw down back and, of course, a sapphire anti-reflective crystal. Now, let's measure this. This is going to be 14.2 uh, millimeters thick. It does have a Swiss Ronda movement that is rock solid, will last five years, and does have an end of life indicator. Lug to lug is going to be 53, and then across is going to be 47. But if you go diagonally, it's going to be um, a 45, and that's what this watch measures. And I'll show it to you again on my wrist real quick. That's what it looks like on my wrist, which is 7.25 inches. So this one is a winner. I love what Bear Grylls is doing. I love what Tide is doing with um, all these watch companies making these recycled, um, up-recycled uh, plastic cases to uh, save the ocean. And I love conservation pieces. So this one right now is available at azfontime.com. It's $9.75. It is in stock now. Let me know what you think about this Bear Grylls watch. I really love it. That's the watch once over for today. My name is Big E. God bless. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And as usual, I'll catch you guys on the next video.